Hey guys, it's bro you whack and I'm so excited to be bringing you this video because it's been far too long since I brought you a top 5 skin video because if you guys remember last week I did the top 5 best 2018 summer game skins and the week before that I was on vacation so I looked at the top 5 worst event skins but if you guys don't know how this works this is season 2 of my top 5 series where I leave it up to you guys to vote for what hero you want to see for the next week. Now last time we did a voting poll it was on the top 5 best honest skins and and also, I didn't add the poll right away, so some of you guys might not have been able to vote, but I think you know who won, because it was either between the man, the myth, and the loser, Soldier 76, and also the dude, Lucio. And would you believe it, Lucio came away <laughs> with over 77 percent of the votes. God, I would have expected these results from May, because, you know, May... It's probably the most hated hero in Overwatch, but dog, no, it's Soldier 76. But I can totally understand because even I don't love Soldier 76 that much. So today we're gonna be looking at the top five best Lucio skins. But as always, I need you guys to do one simple tiny little favor, and that's not the only thing tiny, but pop it on the screen right now is a poll between the top five best Soldier skins versus the top five best Tracer skins. I need you guys to vote for what hero you wanna see for next week's top five video. Usually I always have some sort of theme, one time I did, you know, the Grandads, Reaper, and Soldier. Now I'm just kind of picking random heroes. And I figured, well, Tracer got a brand new skin, so it'd be the perfect time to do the top five best Tracer skins. And she also has a lot of freaking... I could easily do a top 10 video for her. Heck, I might even do that. I probably won't because that'd be like a 50 minute long video. But let's focus on this week's video. And that is looking at the top five best Lucio skins. Starting off our list at number five is a skin that I honestly constantly forget is a Lucio skin. But I guess I have an appreciation for and that is Lucio's breakaway skin so out of the two hockey skins that he has I like breakaway more because I, he has a hockey helmet and he has like a purple visor so I like that one more than the other one but I said that this was a skin I often find myself forgetting just because it's a hockey skin and you guys have to remember I grew up in Arizona my whole entire life so hockey wasn't the sport that me and a lot of other kids grew up playing okay you either played baseball because it was a classic sport or you played basketball because it was an Eric condition we don't have those ice ponds in the middle of winter that you can easily just go and play ice hockey with your friend no we don't have any of that and along with that we do have an NHL team called the Coyotes but they're the worst team in the NHL and I don't even follow hockey and I know that they're the worst team of all time so that's just <laughs> that's just more of a reason for me to forget about the sport let alone the skin but still a cool skin no less, so that's why I put it at number 5. I know I really didn't talk about the skin all too much, more or less I talk about me, but, you know, that's just, I, I don't know. It's a cool skin, I like, I appreciate the sport, I don't want to say I like the sport, I appreciate the sport hockey, I appreciate the skin, and that's why I put it at number 5. If you're a hockey player, you probably put this at number 1, and you probably hate me. But so do my ex-girlfriends. That's why I'm single. <laughs> but now taking in the number four spot is another sporty skin for Lucio, which he has a lot of sports skins. But hey, he's just an active guy. At number four, it is going to be Lucio striker skin. So Lucio received two soccer or football. For the rest of the video, I'm going to call it his football skins, so I don't offend more people that like, oh, you're Branson you soccer. You're still. <sighs> I'm just trying to live my life, yo. <laughs> for the 2016 Summer Games event, he received two football skins. And out of the two, I just like Striker more. One, because the, the color scheme is just a lot more cleaner. I like the white with the red and blue. The other one, it has a more Brazilian uh, color scheme, which is fine. But I don't know. I just feel like Striker is a lot more cleaner. And, and two, it's also easier to say. That's not the reason why I put it on this list, but that's a reason why I also like it more. <laughs> As terms of the skin, it's pretty plain for a 2016 skin that came out in the first event ever. You have to realize they weren't they weren't getting so detail-y, that's not even a word, up until, well, the 2016 Halloween event. But I think this is a pretty solid skin, especially if you play a lot of Lucio Ball. If you don't have any of the football skins, then, dog, what are you doing with your life? But it's also still a solid skin. He has a bunch of Lucio Balls on his back with goalie gloves also his pants represent a, a football pattern or whatnot it's just a solid skin is what I'm trying to say it's not the flashiest but realize it came out in 2016 for the first event but it fits perfectly with the Lucio Ball event and also if you're top 500 you need a Lucio Ball skin okay no questions asked just get it all right but coming in the middle of our list is a skin that I'm gonna be honest guys I don't know why it came with this specific event but at number three it is gonna be the 2018 archive event exclusive skin equalizer so again this skin came out with the archive event and I was like okay that's cool 
But what does this have to do with Overwatch lore? You know what I'm trying to say? Because this is the only opportunity where they can bring skins from specific comments, specific uh, uh, cinematics, or just stuff that we've seen in the storytelling version of Overwatch. I haven't seen this in any of those, and I was like, okay, why? But I'm glad it's here. But why? <laughs> Other than that, the concept of the skin works perfectly for Lucio. Lucio is from Brazil, so you often see that kind of vibe going on with his attire, with, with his dreads, with his headband, with his lack of shirt. Oh. But also, he's a DJ too. And that's obviously the main attraction of this skin is the little... Okay, so I want to be honest, guys. I still don't know what these things are called. I literally had to Google it, but... I don't know what the name of it is, so I googled bouncy soundbars and nothing came up, so I'm gonna be calling them bouncy soundbars. All the people that mix and master audio are cringing right now, but I don't know what they're called, but it's cool because he's a DJ and the sound that's going on is represented with his pants. So if it didn't have this attraction, it wouldn't be on this list. That's why his other skin that looks similar to this isn't on this list just because it's a little bit bland, but the fact that his bouncy soundbars are on his pants, ah, oh, makes me love this skin. But now let's get into the juicy skins for Lucio. At number two is a skin that is hated by the god Lucio player himself, DSP Stanky, which, rest in peace DSP Stanky, he doesn't play or post Overwatch anymore. I'm pretty sad by that. At number two, it is gonna be his Hippity Hop skin. So this is clearly a skin inspired from the EDM artist Dead Mouse. If you guys don't know who he is, he's pretty much the grandfather of dubstep and electronic dance music with like Skrillex and all of them but he's often seen at concerts wearing this big giant mouse helmet or whatnot if you don't know who dead mouse is you probably know his counterpart that is a little bit more relevant in today's world of EDM which is marshmallow he does the exact same thing but with like a marshmallow helmet now the reason why that's very important for me to tell you guys is because Lucio is inspired from that character dead mouse there's a lot of different aspects about him first and foremost the fact that he has EDM music that heals or speeds people around him is a big giveaway his mascot or his logo is this big giant frog you can often see that with Lucio merch or his icon But now his mask is just inspired from it, too It's not a dead mouse or just a mouse helmet. It's his icon, which is a frog mask So that's why I really do like it because again Lucio just he's a cool dude and EDM music is a pretty popular genre But the fact that they just take the grandfather EDM music and make a hero around that same idea is just so cool and really awesome and the fact that his lights change with his ribbit skin, I just chose Hippity Hop because if you want the gold Lucio gun, you can get it with this skin, but... <laughs> With his hip, uh, with his ribbit skin, it does change colors based on what song you are playing. If you're playing the heel song, his eyes and his lights around him change yellow, and if you're playing the speed song, it changes to green. But hippity hop, again, you get the Lucio gold gun, so that's why I like that one better. <laughs> but now we need to talk about the best Lucio skin of all time. You knew it was going to be somewhere on the list, and you probably knew at what spot just because of everything that comes with the skin. But coming in as the best Lucio skin of all time, it's going to be his 2017 anniversary skin jazzy where do I even start when talking about the jazzy skin well first let's talk about the song because this is the first thing that you notice when you play with this skin in game is that they completely change the music when you're switching between songs when you switch to the, the speed song it plays this more fast-paced uh, what is it a trumpet or, or saxophone like music and then when you switch it to the heel song it has a lot more piano or just a lot more harp or or, or slow jazz music Obviously the name is Jazzy, so it's not gonna be playing EDM music. It's gonna be playing jazz music But now let's talk about his attire because my boys This is what the modern-day Frank Sinatra would look like if Frank Sinatra was black because they just made his attire Just look so beautiful and really represent what a modern-day jazz musician would look like They took the retro aspects but implemented to have this futuristic aspect with a classic black vest white shirt Fedora and really cool shades, but also changing his robotic aspect Aspects. A lot of the equipment that was used to play jazz music back in the day is now redesigned to have this robotic form And that's why I really appreciate the skin because not only do they have this retro modern jazz look But they also redesigned aspects about them to have a different feel for this legendary skin You feel like you're playing well, not entirely But you feel like there's different parts about the skin that is well worth a thousand credits or maybe three thousand credits when you first bought the skin So this is the definition 
addition of a legendary skin that I just absolutely love. And you've seen a lot more modern legendary skins in Overwatch do this with like the Pink Mercy skin when you use your ultimate, it plays a different jingle than just what the basic skin would play. But anyway guys, that is my list of the top five best Lucio skins in Overwatch. I feel like there's a small group of Lucio players that are very vocal whenever it comes to their skins. So please, if you're one of those players, let me know in the comments down below what your favorite skins are. Because I guarantee you, your list is different than mine. And that's why I bring these skin videos because we can just finally express what our favorite Lucio skins or any hero skins are in the game. So I love you guys. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys vote for next week's top five video. And I look forward to you then. So I love you guys and bye.